Hey everybody, it's Abby. Welcome back to the channel. Welcome if you're new. Today is going to be another installment of my Earth Month series. And set it right for the second time in a row again. Yay, go me. But today I'm going to be making an Instant Pot recipe um, that you can do pretty quickly. I did this in way less than an hour and most of that was just waiting for the Instant Pot to pressurize. But this is the vegan curried cauliflower soup with lentils from the website vegetariangastronomy.com. Not affiliated with them, of course, just... I happen to be trying this recipe at the same time I needed to film this video, so here we are. And yes, you're welcome for that carrot sequence. But you can save a lot of money by eating at home, especially with Instant Pot meals or, or uh, slow cooker meals, because you can make a whole bunch at one time and you're not tempted to go out to eat at work if you have food already in the fridge. Well, I am still tempted, but it's a lot easier to resist the temptation. When you already have something right there, you don't even have to go get in your car to go get it. But this also does help save waste by not using um, the disposable stuff that you get at fast food places like utensils and the wrappers and bags and cups and straws and all that stuff. You just use whatever you have at home, which is reusable. And this is great if you are in a hurry all the time, or if you are maybe a student, or if you have a big family, you can use the Instant Pot to make some pretty easy meals. You could even um, rinse it out after you do this, and then make some rice in the Instant Pot. It's pretty quick. White rice only takes about two minutes to pressure cook, plus a few minutes to, you know, pressurize. But I really like how this recipe turned out. Let me know what you think about the video. And let me know if you have any Instant Pot recipes for um, that are vegan, of course. And yeah, give this video a thumbs up if you thought it was helpful. And let me know if you have any more tips for being sustainable, a little more eco-friendly. I've really liked reading your responses so far. And be sure to subscribe so I don't miss any future videos. And I will see you then. Bye.